So what exactly is an association and how is it structured? Let's begin with how an association is formed. A homeowner association or condominium association is a nonprofit corporation usually established by a real estate developer for the purpose of marketing, managing, and selling homes or lots in a community, or selling units in a multifamily development. The governing documents of the association grants the developer special voting rights in the operation of the association. They also allow the developer to exit financial and legal responsibility of the association by transferring ownership to the homeowners. This happens after the sale of a predetermined number of homes, lots, or units, or after a specific set date in the future. Membership in the homeowners association or condominium association by a home buyer is generally a condition of the purchase and opting out of an association is generally not an option. Homeowner associations have become increasingly common in the United States and it is estimated that as of 2010, 24.8 million American homes and 62 million residents come under the governance of a homeowners association. An association provides members with shared community benefits and increased property values by sharing common expenses such as landscaping and swimming pools, for example. This is done through the enforcement of the Declaration of Covenants, Conditions, and Restrictions to achieve a community representative of such values as established in the original governing documents. By sharing expenses and enforcing the covenants, the entire membership benefits as a whole. For example, a member wishes to paint their home purple with pink trim. While the member wishing to do this may personally benefit from this particular color scheme, it could negatively impact the property values of other members. An association that follows and enforces the guidelines set forth by the governing documents ultimately protects the integrity and property values of the entire community.